Hi my dear students today we will discuss about main difference between proceeds and macro this is very very important in the exam point of view also they will maximum times this ask what is the main difference between procedure and macro if you see the procedure and macro is same but now we will go for some the macro uses more memory that is only the desert one days so we will discuss in detail about the main difference between procedure and macro <music> difference between macro and procedure right first we will go for macros then we go for a procedure what is the another name for procedure already told please tell me what is the another name of procedure that is we can call it is subroutine we can call it is our sub program we can call it is a sub program right now coming to the first one now first one macros are used for short sequence of instructions preferably below 10 instructions below 10 instructions it will use for below 10 instructions what is that macros are used for short sequence of instructions short sequence it is used for short sequence of instructions preferably below 10 instructions whereas procedure that is subroutines are used for long sequence of instructions long sequence of instructions and preferably more than 10 and more than 10 instructions see more than 10 instructions this is below 10 instruction this is above 10 or more than 10 instructions now coming to the second point second point macros does not require call and return instructions see call and return it is not used this is not used in macros but whereas subroutines requires it require it requires call and return instruction remember this is very very important call and return in, in instructions now coming to the third one now coming to the third one macros execute faster when compared with the subroutines why you tell me it is very short less than 10 instructions right that's why it execute fast right that's why it executes fast macros execute faster when when compared with the compared with the subroutines compared with the subroutines whereas subroutines is nothing but what procedures remember that is very very important remember coming to third one these procedures are subroutines are slower compared to macros compared to macros next fourth one parameters are passed parameter are passed faster parameters are passed as a part of statement passed as a part of statement part of statement which calls macro which calls macro there is coming to the procedure parameters are passed in a registers remember this is parameters are passed in registers in registers memory locations
are stacks are stacks next next one is machine code is generated here every time machine code generated machine code generated every time every time when macro is called when macro is called here only one time remember only one time machine code generated machine code generated for procedures here in the procedures only one time the machine code generates but whereas in uh, whereas in macro every time when macro is called every time it is here only one time remember one time now coming to the next one macros eliminates the overhead time required to call the procedure and return to the program macros eliminates the overhead time it eliminates overhead time required to call the procedure and return to the program whereas it requires overhead time right already we discussed it, it requires overhead time it requires overhead time to call the procedure and return to the calling procedure now last one is control of execution remains in the main program control of execution remains in the main program whereas procedures control of execution is transferred to the subroutine right? that is very very important last point is control of execution remains remains in the main program whereas here control of execution is transferred is transfer to the subroutine or procedure so these are the main differences between procedure and macros right dear students please remember this is very very important question especially this is used when we are writing the program right so this will be very helpful in the exam section also right macros are used for short sequence of instructions preferably below 10 instructions whereas subroutines are used for long sequence of instructions preferably 10 and more more than 10 instructions whereas macros does not require call and return but procedure require call and return instructions and macros executes faster than with compared with subroutines procedures whereas subroutines are slower compared to the macros next parameters are passed as a part of statements which calls macro where parameters passed in registers and mem memory locations are stack next one is machine code is generated every time when we are calling macro machine code generates whereas procedure only one time machine code generates and in macros it eliminates power time but in in procedure it requires power ahead time now control of execution remains in the main program is the control of execution transfer to the subroutine or procedure so that is about today's class please want to go through these assembler directives procedure and everything right until then thank you my dear students